Hello everyone, I'm Sarah of Rich Textures Crochet and welcome. Today we are going to learn how to crochet a linked treble crochet stitch. And this one has worked uh, very similar to the linked double crochet stitch tutorial, which you can also find the video for here on my channel. It uh, creates a pretty fabric that you can see here in front of you. It is the same on both sides. Uh, it features nice drape. It works up fairly quickly because of the height of the stitches. So we're going to work on this linked treble crochet stitch together. Today I'm going to be using a little bit of the Karen Times Pantone yarn by Yarnspirations as well as a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook. Links for both of these items can be found in the description of this video. Also in the description of the video, you'll find a link to the free written pattern uh, for this stitch tutorial, and it's there on my blog at richtexturescrochet.com. So thank you so much for joining me. Let me know in the comments if you've ever used this stitch before, and tell me what kind of project you've used it in. Uh, and uh, while you're here, I also invite you to subscribe and take a look around at some of the other tutorials and uh, crochet patterns that you find here. So let's grab our hooks and yarn and learn how to crochet this linked treble crochet. Our linked treble crochet stitch today is worked in rows. So we're going to start by making our slip knot. And for this chain, uh, for this foundation chain, you can work any multiple of stitches. Today I'm going to chain 21. There's 15 and 21. For your first foundation row, you're going to be setting up your stitch, especially in this first stitch here. So to work your first linked treble crochet, you're going to begin by inserting your hook into the second chain. So count in one, two, Insert your hook into that second chain, yarn over, and draw up a loop. You'll have two loops on your hook. Insert your hook into the next chain, yarn over, and draw up a loop. Insert your hook into the next chain, your fourth chain, yarn over, and draw up a loop. You'll now have four loops on your hook. We're now going to work these loops off and complete our first stitch. So to begin, you're going to yarn over, pull through two loops, yarn over, pull through two more, and yarn over and pull through the final two loops on your hook. You're now set to begin your next stitch. When you work your linked treble stitches, the first uh, parts of the stitch are going to be worked in these horizontal bars that cross the post of the stitch that you just made. So if I take out my hook here, across the stitch you can see there's one here and then there's one here and then we come down to our foundation chain. So for the next stitch you're going to begin by inserting your hook under that horizontal bar that goes across the post, the first one, yarn over and draw up a loop repeat that under the next bar, yarn over and draw up a loop, and now you want to go into your foundation chain into the next chain, insert your hook, yarn over and draw up a loop. Four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over and pull through two more. If you've worked Tunisian crochet, you will see that this stitch has a similar feel. You're now going to repeat that all the way across. So into the next, the posts of that stitch that you just made into the horizontal bars that go across, insert your hook, yarn over, draw up a loop, insert your hook, yarn over, draw up a loop. Now into the next stitch on the foundation chain, insert your hook, yarn over and draw up a loop. Complete your stitch by yarning over and pulling through two, 
yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over and pull through two. Now repeat that all the way across. Worked all the way across. This is what your work looks like. You're now going to want to start your second row and to start your second row you're going to chain three. Turn your work. We're now going to work our first linked treble by inserting our hook into the second chain from our hook, yarn over, draw up a loop. Insert your hook into the third chain yarn over and draw up a loop. Now working into the same stitch that your starting chain came out of, insert your hook one more time, yarn over and draw up a loop. With four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over and pull through two more. That is your first stitch worked. You're now going to work your linked stitches all the way across. So under that first horizontal bar, insert your hook, yarn over, draw up a loop, work your way down the post as you did for the first row, and then insert your hook for the final step into the next stitch. With four loops on your hook, yarn over and pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over and pull through two. Repeat that all the way across and then uh, that's it. That's all there is to working the linked treble crochet. Simply repeat that second row for as long as you would like. So thank you so much for joining me on this stitch tutorial and uh, once again I invite you to take a look around and I will see you again next week. Happy crocheting! Bye!